Welcome to the University Cultural Affairs of Negros Oriental State University with ISO 9001 2015 International Standard Certified. Let us take a closer look to the university's home of promising talents. Join me as we unveil the UCA's goal, objectives, programs, services, and its best practices. Dayon ka mo sa Negros Oriental State University. The University Cultural Affairs with ISO 9001-2015 International Standard Certified of Negros Oriental State University, Philippines. The University Cultural Affairs. The Office of the University Cultural Affairs is responsible in the recruitment, selection, admission, and in the holistic development of students' special talents and giftedness in the visual and the performing arts of the university. As stipulated in Article 17 of the University Code of Negros Oriental State University, that there shall be designated center director who the president may deem necessary to perform specific functions of the university for a term to be determined by him or her and subject to the approval of the Board of Regents. To qualify, he or she must be a holder of an appropriate master's degree or preferably a doctoral degree. The UCA logo. The championship trophy with seven intertwining gold ribbons represents cooperation, excellence and honor in all of its endeavors, specifically in the field of arts and cultural affairs across the seven campuses of the university. The flowers are separators for the university cultural affairs and the institution, the Negros Oriental State University, represent the blossoming of talents. The azure blue color of the logo represents the color of the university as reflected in the lyrics of the university hymn. The round-shaped logo represents infinity and the unending achievements in bringing honor and pride to the university. UCA stands for University Cultural Affairs. And this is the home of promising talents. And we are known as Kabilin. The University Cultural Affairs goal, to unceasingly enhance and promote the exceptional talents of the university students in the field of culture and the arts. The University Cultural Affairs objectives, train students with potential skills in visual and the performing arts to become world-class talents and artists. Attract university students to join the cultural affairs of the university as an avenue to develop their fullest potentials. Lead in the promotion of local culture and traditions through visual and the performing arts. Exhibit Philippine culture and traditions through visual and the performing arts. Network with government agencies and the non-governmental organizations for partnerships and linkages relative to cultural affairs. Transform extraordinary talents among young state scholars in the visual and the performing arts to become cultural ambassadors of the university. Showcase local culture and traditions through visual and the performing arts in the university and in the community with the acronym TALENTS. The University Cultural Affairs Organizational Structure. The University Cultural Affairs Services. Cultural shows and public presentations and production services. Planning and Program Coordination Services. Extension Services for Visual and the Performing Arts. Training and Workshop Facilitation and Event Management Services. 
showcase and performance of talents and artists for special occasions and other events services. Ushering and hospitality management and guest relations services. Live music instrumentation services, festival drum beating services. Costume rental services. Beauty care and makeup services and tutorial special class services on visual and the performing arts and debate quiz ball coaching classes. The University Cultural Affairs Facilities, Office of the University Cultural Affairs Director, the University Cultural Complex, the University Amphitheater, the University Grand Chorale and Rehearsal Room. The University Kabilin Band and Performing Arts Center. The University Costumes and Instruments Facility. The University Dance Arena. The University Dance Studio. The University Kabilin Dance Company Artistic Director's Cubicle. The University Kabilin Rondalia Room. The University Cultural Affairs Trainers and Faculty Lounge. The University Cultural Affairs Deliberation and Adoration Room. The University Cultural Affairs Office of the Property Custodians. The University Cultural Affairs Audition and Function Room. The University Equipo de Artista Visuales Veranda. The University Dance Company Lounge. The University Makeup Artist Preparation Room. The University Cultural Affairs Sewing Room. The University Cultural Affairs Conference and Viewing Room. The University Cultural Affairs Festival Drum Beaters Cubicle. The University Cultural Affairs Radio Drama Cubicle. The University Cultural Affairs Ensembles. The Kabilin Dance Company develops and trains talents and artists in folk, contemporary, hip hop, modern, ballet, jazz, indigenous, dance sport, and other foreign and international dance genres with 270 training hours per semester, equivalent to 15 units. The Kabilin Grand Corral refines and seasons tonal qualities, prowess, and improves the singing voices and choral singing techniques of talents and artists in all music genres, with 270 training hours per semester, equivalent to 15 units. The Kabilin University Band exposes and enriches the talents and artist skills in playing different marching band instruments and other musical gadgets and implements with 270 training hours per semester equivalent to 15 units. The Kabilin Solo and Duet Fam discovers and hones unique individual singing skills and vocal qualities of talents and artists in both solo and duet renditions with 54 training hours per semester equivalent to three units. The Kabilin Grupo Artista Intablado enhances the acting and dramatic skills of talents and artists for theater and promotes advocacy on social issues through theater arts, stage dramatics, musical drama, and stage productions, with a total of 270 training hours per semester, equivalent to 15 units. The Kabilin Festival Drum Beaters Troupe trains skillful talents and artists in festival drum beating and other folkloric and cultural festival instrumentations with a total of 54 training hours per semester equivalent to three units. 
the Kabilin Rondale Ensemble. Enhances and uncovers hidden skills in playing Rondalia instruments and promotes Philippine folk and traditional music. With a total of 270 training hours per semester, equivalent to 15 units. The Kabilin Pylon Project Live Band develops potential artists in live band instrumentation and live band lead vocal singing renditions with a total of 270 training hours per semester, equivalent to 15 units. The Kabilin Makeup Artist Team hones and trains potential talents and artists in beauty care, makeup, and hair styling with a total of 54 training hours per semester, equivalent to three units. The Kabilian Twirls and Flags cohort selects and trains the best and qualified Norsunian ladies for the university marching bands, majorettes and minorettes and flag bearers with a total of 270 training hours per semester, equivalent to 15 units. The Kabilian Attaches educates and trains potential talents and artists as student ambassadors in diplomatic, civic affairs, and all academic and official affairs in the university and community functions, with a total of 54 training hours per semester, equivalent to three units. The Kabilin X Factor Talents Unlimited promotes extraordinary talents and special skills, which are a potential source of good and wholesome entertainment, with a total of 54 training hours per semester equivalent to three units. The Kabilin Equipo de Artista Visuales trains potential artists in painting, calligraphy, charcoal, pencil rendering, drawing, sketching, technology assisted arts, graphic arts, printing, videography, photography, and other forms of visual arts with a total of 54 training hours per semester equivalent to three units. The Kabilin University Debaters and Quiz Ball Masters produces potential debaters and quiz masters to represent the university in off-campus competitions with a total of 54 training hours per semester equivalent to three units. The Kabilin Event Management Team trains potential event managers and stage production coordinators, as well as enhances artists and talent skills in stage lights and sounds directing, stage decorations and stage setup design skills, stage crew management skills, stage sets and props design skills, and event planning and scheduling skills, with a total of 54 training hours per semester, equivalent to three units. The Kabilian Tingog sa Kahanginan Audio Theater equips talents and artists with the knowledge, awareness, and skills to be able to set up, operate, and manage interactive radio drama projects and radio plays, with a total of 54 training hours per semester, equivalent to three units. The University Cultural Affairs Recruitment, Selection, and Admission Processes for new talents and artists. Recruitment process, offline, online modalities. An aspirant, one, submits to the UCA Office of the Director his or her intention to join. A template letter is provided by the UCA Office Secretary. Two, fills up registration and submits accomplished form to the UCA Office Secretary. Three, waits for the schedule of screening you may submit your application to these email addresses. Selection process. A recruit, one, attends the orientation program as a requirement. Two, submits for audition process and complies other specific requirements. Three, waits for the screening results and the advice to proceed. Once accepted and duly endorsed by the UCA director, 
A recruit is now labeled talent or artists. The admission process. A new entrant, talent or artist, one, secures endorsement letter from the UCA director to be forwarded to the concerned coaches and trainers. Two, upon submission of the endorsement letter, the new entrant attends the second orientation of the chosen ensemble. Three, attends the regular rehearsals and practices prior to the selection process and follows rules and guidelines of the university cultural affairs, specifically on 3.1, attendance to scheduled practices and rehearsals of at least 90% of the total number of required training hours, face-to-face -face or virtual schemes. 3.2, participation to university and outreach performances. 3.3, involvement to extension programs and activities. The retention policies of the regular Norsu Kabilin talents and artists. In order to be retained in the Kabilin cultural ensembles, the following must be strictly observed and attained. One, the talents and artists are required to maintain their 90% attendance requirement from the required total number of training hours of the chosen ensemble as provided in the return service policy of the university. Please refer to the ensemble's required number of training hours per semester. Two, must continually uphold the rules and regulations of the university cultural affairs and the university policies as provided in the Norso Student Handbook in general. Three, a talent or artist is advised to stop or discontinue his or her training if the 90% attendance requirement is not attained and by a recommendation letter from his or her coach or trainer to stop for reasons of unfitness and incompetence. A talent or artist must pass a series of skill tests according to the level aspired. These skill tests or performance assessment and evaluation will determine the level of the talent or artist. To it, 80 to 84, newbie, star award or medal, bronze. 85 to 89, trainee, star award or medal, silver. 90 to 94, underling, star award or medal, gold. 95 to 97, junior rate, star award or medal, diamond. 98 to 100, exemplar, star award or medal, platinum. Four, a talent or artist who did not pass a series of skill tests is given twice the chance before advised to continue or quit in the training. Five, on probation or OP may be imposed to talents or artists who are considered improving talents and may continue until such time the concerned trainer or coach recognizes his or her potentialities and may be accepted again as a returning new B. Performance Assessment and Evaluation of Artists of Norsu or Payan. General Instructions. A UCA artist or talent is required to submit for a performance assessment and evaluation every end of the school year. This performance evaluation is conducted by the concerned trainers, coaches, as well as the director of the University Cultural Affairs for the artist skills leveling and recognition. Specific requirements. Before the performance evaluation, the following must be satisfied. One, an artist or talent must secure from the UCE office the endorsement letter and certification of affiliation. Two, an artist or talent must have at least 90% in attendance of the required number of training hours. Three, an artist or talent must submit for the scheduling of assessment from the University Cultural Affairs. Four, an artist or talent during the performance assessment must be in an appropriate attire as required by their respective trainers or coaches. During the performance evaluation, 
the following must be strictly observed. One, no one is allowed inside the performance room except A, the concerned trainer or coach. B, the UCA director. C, the assessment recorder. D, the guest evaluator. And E, the artist or the talent. Two, an artist or talent is given three to five minutes to present his or her repertoire or piece for the performance evaluation. Three, a waiting section inside the performance room is provided to the artist or talent after his or her performance while the evaluators are deliberating the results. Four, after the evaluator's deliberation, the artist or talent is duly notified by his or her score before the latter is permitted to leave. After the performance evaluation, the following are to be implemented. One, the concerned artist or talent is given the necessary certification of award, grade, star award, or the medal, and cash incentives if budget warrants in accordance to the obtained score or level. Two, a recognition day for outstanding UCA artists and talents is scheduled by the University Cultural Affairs. Requests for invitation and engagement to the University Cultural Affairs workflow of Negros Oriental State University. Process one. One A. The requesting entity or office writes to the office of the university president for cultural and arts related engagements with the university cultural affairs through the offices of the vice presidents. 1B, the Office of the Vice President for Administration and Finance receives the letter of request. And 1C, the Office of the Vice President for Academic Affairs for their recommending approval and other important notifications before the letter of request is respectfully forwarded to the Office of the University President. 1D, the Office of the University President receives the letter from the offices of the Vice Presidents through the Office Secretary and will be forwarded to the University President for his or her remarks on the letter of request. The Office of the President Releasing Section forwards the letter of request to the Office of the Director of the University Cultural Affairs. 2A. The Director of the University Cultural Affairs receives the letter of request and takes appropriate action on the remarks made by the University President. 2B, the Director of the University Cultural Affairs through the UCA Secretary communicates and conversely to the requesting party regarding important details on the request. Process 3, the Director of the University Cultural Affairs calls for a special meeting to concern trainers and coaches for the scheduling. Process 4, Preparation of all necessary documents, attachments, such as travel itineraries, travel orders, list of involved personnel and artists or talents, as well as their medical certificates, parents' consents, and waivers and other required documents. Process 5. Constant feedback and communication to the requesting entity or office and reversely for their other requirements and specifications, such as the final venue, rehearsal schedules, transportation itineraries, final instructions, accommodation, receptions including food provisions, and other salient points to ponder prior to the final scheduled performance and engagement. Process 6. The actual date or dates of engagement. Process 7. After the request or the engagement is served, the UCA director then gives feedback to the university president regarding the turnout of the events of the UCA's engagement with the requesting entity or office. Hiring of the University Cultural Affairs Trainers and Coaches. One, applicant must submit a letter of application to the office of the university president through the following offices. 
Office of the University Director for Cultural Affairs, Office of the Vice President for Academic Affairs, Office of the Vice President for Administration and Finance, and the Human Resource Management Office. Two, applicant will be notified for his or her schedules for the Personal Selection Board, Panel Interview, and Teaching Demonstration or Skill Test. Three, orientation and familiarization of newly hired professional trainers and coaches follows regarding on the rules and policies of the NORSO UCA at the Office of the University Director for Cultural Affairs. Four, EDTR enrollment of the newly hired professional trainers, coaches, and other office personnel is immediately scheduled at the Human Resource Management Office. Five, logging in and out of trainers and coaches are required for the daily monitoring of attendances. 